Hello everyone, I'm Shraddha Burkunde. I'm a science communicator at ISA Pune. This video, along with 15 videos, is part of our Wednesday series. This series is conceptualized and developed by Science Activity Center and is supported and funded by Pratham Education Foundation. These videos will be premiered every Wednesday at 7 p.m. on this channel. So subscribe to this channel and let us know in the comment section if you like this video. Observe these three balloons. What makes two of them sing and the third go up? How do we make this happen? Let's find out. The red balloon is inflated with the gas produced by mixing baking soda and vinegar which are readily available in the kitchen. Pour approximately 30 ml of vinegar in a bottle. Fill a balloon with baking soda using a spoon or a paper. Attach the balloon to the mouth of the bottle. Invert the balloon so that the baking soda falls into the vinegar. The gas produced is then collected in the balloon. Remove the red balloon and tie a knot. Here you have your first balloon. Inflate a yellow balloon to the same size as the red one by blowing into it and your second balloon is ready. Now for the floating balloon, we will need a glass bottle, sodium hydroxide or NaOH, aluminium foil and a green balloon. Add one spoon of sodium hydroxide or NaOH in a glass. You can also use drain cleaner. Add about 50 ml of cold water and swirl. Make small crumpled pieces of aluminium. Transfer the NaOH solution in a glass bottle and add 4 to 5 crumpled aluminium pieces to it. Fit a green balloon on the mouth of the bottle. The gas will get collected in the balloon. Be careful as this reaction produces heat. And the gas in the balloon is highly flammable. Tie a thread to the balloon. You will notice that this balloon goes up in the air. Why do these balloons act differently? Curious to know which gases are filled in each of these balloons? Find out in the next part. Strange Balloons Part 2